Hello, welcome back. The topic today is obesity and menopause, the effect of uh, weight on menopause. In the previous videos, uh, uh, we talked about morbid obesity, the effect of morbid obesity on women, especially their periods. You know, they, have, they may have uh, irregular periods, excess periods, excess blood loss, painful periods, or even infertility. Now, in this video, we are going to see the effect of uh, weight on menopause. See, the uh, data, what it shows is, 50% of the obese people, morbid obese people, will have a very late menopause. That means they will, they will have their menstrual cycles for a prolonged period. Usually, uh, uh, people below 45 years is called the early menopause, and 45 to 50 or 52 is uh, it's a normal one. And now, more than 52 or 55 is called very, very, very late menopause. What is that effect? So, if they have a very late menopause, the hormone effect on the body is very high, especially on the ovary. Uh, uterus, cervix and the breast. So the chances of uh, cancers in these organs, cervical cancer, breast cancer, uterine cancer and ovarian cancer increases uh, uh, marginally. And if in the video, previous videos we also told obese children, they uh, attain men menarchy, they, get, uh, they become, uh, you know, uh, start uh, menstruation very early. So early uh, menstruation and late periods. So exposure of hormone is very prolonged. So this prolonged uh, hormone exposure increases the chances of cancers, number one. Number two, very importantly, there is a common, uh, 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 people know that, you know, uh, uh, as long as the women are menstruating, their heart is protected. But these morbid obese people with prolonged uh, menstruation, the heart is not protected. There is a 30 to 60 percent increase in heart failures and heart diseases. So uh, definitely obesity is not good for the uh, hormonal effect on the uterus, ovary and breast as well as the heart. So definitely you have to lose your weight and if you cannot lose your weight by diet exercise, you have to discuss with these problems with your uh, you know, a bariatric surgeon and if, if needed, maybe bariatric surgery is a solution to your uh, um, weight gain problem. Thank you.